Looking for the cheapest coins on the internet right now? Look no further than my sponsor, Mutt Coin Bank, guys. You seriously cannot beat that value. I promise. Use code Poodle for five percent off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today we have a few things to go over. First off, it's Thursday LTDs, of course, guys. So off the rip, right? Off the rip, we have some LTDs to go over. Then, of course, we have a Sugar Rush sneak peek reveal, sort of, kind of. And then, of course, we also have a um, a reveal tonight for Sugar Rush part two so that's pretty cool guys so stay tuned for that later so we have reveals we have ltds we have a title update today as well and and we have the uh the leak player right not leak but it was a early reveal we'll call it right so before we get into that guys before we get into the video go down below hit that subscribe button turn on that noti bell give this video a big thumbs up as always guys if you haven't already make sure to always give this video a big thumbs up and of course subscribe to the channel if you guys need coins, head over to Muck Coin Bank down below and use code Poodle at checkout for five percent off your order. Yeah, let's get into it. So, off the rip, guys, we have uh, maybe our Good Morning Madden pack. Guess not. I mean, if you guys didn't see, by the way, there is a new way to go ahead and claim that. You have to like go into uh, Twitch and watch like a fifteen-minute portion of the stream, something like that, and claim it. If you guys didn't see, go watch the stream the uh, from this morning, and you will be able to check out kind of how to do that process. Kind of tedious, kind of annoying, but. It is what it is, right? Now, that stream went super long. That was a 30-minute stream. Kind of ridiculous, quite honestly. But at least the LTDs are up, right? So, we got Ben Ardrick McKinney as one of them. Now, he's not good at all. Middle linebacker. First off, middle linebacker, right? 98 overall middle linebacker. Not going to be liked. Secondly, he's got only 91 speed. So, powered up, chemmed up, and everything. He's getting to like a 94, 95 max. Uh, not going to cut it, especially at middle linebacker. Now, he does have some other redeeming qualities. Like, he's going to have a 95 excel. He'll have 99 tackle, 99 play rec, 98 block, 99 hit power, and about an 85 zone. So, Card the card stat wise isn't horrible and he's six foot four too, which is pretty huge. You know, 95 speed, six foot four. But he's a linebacker, and at linebacker, if you're not getting 99 speed right now, even if people just don't like linebackers, right? They rather just rock with safety. Safeties are faster, they 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 animate better, and they just play better, right? That's kind of just been how this year's been. It sucks that it has to be this way, but that's how the game is coded for some odd reason. 62 speed, low change of direction. He'll have 99 impact blocking though. I mean, like I said, besides like the speed and his position, he wouldn't have been such a bad card, but that's just the nature of the game nowadays, right? It sucks because I used to, middle linebackers used to be one of the most, like, the favorite drops of whenever, right? When we got middle linebackers, we were always so hyped because middle linebackers use their linebacker. That used to be a super big thing, guys. Getting a good linebacker was, like, Christmas and, you know, Christmas and mutt. So, it's kind of upsetting to see the days of middle linebackers gone or all linebackers, right? If they're not, if they're not a pass-rushing outside linebacker, people just don't use them or really care for them at all, which kind of sucks. I used, to be, I used to really love, I used to love middle linebacker it's it's such a shame to see they've gotten to this point but hopefully next gen uh you know next gen madden madden 22 the new minute not this current next gen's ass but the next next gen the, the current next gen the new madden that one's gonna be pretty great hopefully i hope they uh, they adjust some stuff bring back middle linebackers make defensive tackles worthwhile right because if next gen's accurate the way it's supposed to be it's supposed to use weight height and stuff to mimic certain things so Maybe getting, you know, a 250-pound outside edge rusher at defensive tackle, they're just going to get killed and tossed around by the interior line, right? But maybe you have to get you get a 350-pound at Damon Harrison. He's going to move bodies, right? So that's kind of my hope here, at least, like, in terms of at least pushing back on the line or something. But moving on, guys, we do have another LT to go over. Now, he's going to be a lot more expensive, so don't expect him to be anywhere down there. We'll just filter this out, of course, because that, that could take a while to find him. Newest. Alvin Kamara. Now, Alvin Kamara is going to be super expensive, guys. Probably the best running back on current gen. Now, he's going He's going to be going for at least 100 k for quite a while. Now, beauty of this car, guys, is everything you want. So, he's got 96 speed, 97 excel, 98 agility, 93 carrying, 88 catching, 97 change of direction, 89 trucking, 98 break tackle. I like how they're finally giving Kamara good cards. In the last three years of Madden, they've given him horrible cards. Like, always under, always slow, and, you know, oh, just always slow. Slow and tiny, right? Which made no sense because he's super, he's super fast and super. He, like they said, no, he's he's quick. You know, he's not fast. No, he's fast. He may he's quick, but he's fast. Now, powered up and chemmed up is the beauty of this card. So, powered up and chemmed up, he'll have 99 speed, 98 excel, 99 agility, 94 carrying. He may even get 90 catching depending on the chems you use, which is pretty crazy. He'll get 99 change of direction. He'll get above 90 trucking. And he'll have 99 break tackle. So, he'll be the best receiving back in the game. The best elusive back probably in the game, and the best um, break one of the best break tackle backs in the game, while also being a moderately high range power back, which is absolutely absurd. 81 strength for Kamara is crazy. Uh, 96 jumping is crazy. 
what's it called stiff arm gonna be over 95 which is crazy 99 juke move 90 probably get like to almost a 99 spin 84 spectacular catch 88 medium route running guys honestly i might recommend if it was up to me since juke's already gonna be a 99 right juke's already gonna be a 99 i would put like play fake on him i think i'd put play fake you may be able to get his catch and traffic up to a 90 and his medium at running above a 90 as well as his short running is already above 90 guys or even go deep guys honestly alvin kamara i don't think i'd put a run i don't think i put zone around him because powered up and chemdiff guys he's gonna get the break tackle get the change of direction get the speed and get the juke to 99 on his own so instead of wasting your zone run if you put a receiving on him you're gonna get him to get above a uh, 90 route running like all across the board like that's crazy in my opinion that's crazy i would definitely focus on that or maybe even do go deep because you can get the deep route running to 90. You already have the short and the medium will be at an 89. And the catch in traffic, right? That he's, he's this is a crazy card, guys. This card's absolutely absurd. And I, I do a lot of receiving with my running back, so I definitely do like this. Now, um, guys, we do have the title updates and stuff, so I'm gonna take you over to some screenshots, go over a few players, go over some screenshots of the title update. Not not you know, nothing too crazy. Real quick, this is just like a brief screenshot that I did get of it. Like there's the full title update on um you could type in gridiron notes or man 21 gridiron notes you'll see it'll be the first thing there so key highlights multiple on field play and animation fixes gameplay updates fix the issue allowing the play to sometimes be incorrectly blown dead if the quarterback stilled still for a significant duration of time um this would happen when a user on defense would put extra defenders in coverage facing the offensive user to wait for a receiver to break open versus the additional defenders and covers the play would be blown dead to the logic that it was incorrectly detecting the forward progress to be stopped in the situation we have corrected Fix an exploit allowing the user on defense to go offside to block a field goal while losing. And after the penalty was accepted, the half would end without another attempt on the untimed down. Fix an issue causing multiple sideline characters to clip into the walls in the Falcon stadiums. Fix an issue causing the center to sometimes fall to the ground at the snap on under center plays. This was caused by a detective physics collision between the center and the quarterback that led to a stumble animation, which had been fixed. So guys, of course, there's going to be more. If you want to see them more. You gotta go over to you know Madden Gridiron Notes and go ahead and actually read them. They'll be there. The whole thing will be there. I don't think it was too huge. Oh, uh, we have Madden Bowl LCQ format three day mud limited ladder on uh, Bat uh, Bat Leffy. Bat Leffy. I don't say that. Four two four three four four. Top one hundred twenty eight players for each console advance to the double elimination bracket. Three day elimination. Uh, three day double elimination bracket will be four nine four ten four eleven. Top eight from last chance qualifier qualify for the Madden Bowl four per console. Both console first place are captains. Moving on, this was uh, the stream thing I want to show you with the claim uh, claim now. You go to like Twitch drops, you go to inventory, you go to claim now, need the Good Morning Madden pack, and it requires you to watch like 15 minutes of the stream, which kind of sucks. But um, so out of that, and then of course, guys, this is the uh, teased player Casey Hayward Jr. for the Chargers, guys. Once again, why are we getting secondary players with 95 speed? The hundred time Charles Woodson back in Christmas had a 95 speed. Why are we still getting players like that? But nonetheless, guys, his zone will not get to 99. His press will not get to 99. His speed will not get to 99. This card's ass. We have plenty of guys like him. We have plenty 95 speed corners that get to 99, man. We, we don't need that, right? We want a guy that can get the press zone, man, and the speed all at the same time while being tall. Because that's what we're missing at this point. If we have, No, that's what we want. That's the only thing that like would, would actually be an improvement on what we have. But that's KCA with Junior right there. Not a great card. The jumping's low. Um... I don't remember his height. I, I feel like he's like moderately tall. Like he's not like a midget, but I don't think he's super tall either. I could be entirely wrong on that front. But like I said, in my opinion, Casey Hayward is not is not a good card. He never really gets good cards anymore though. Like we're, we're beyond the days of Casey Hayward getting really good Madden cards. Yeah, he's five foot eleven exactly. So he's not like a midget. Like he's not like five foot ten, five foot nine, five foot eight. You know, from he's on the border, custom six. I would say he's on the smaller side, but he's not exactly. But he's not. You know, he's not a midget either. But Casey Hayward's um. He's, he's decent at best. I would I would say maybe a Chargers theme team. That's that's about it. But that's about it for the video, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you the channel, hit that subscribe button, turn that notification bell, give this video a big thumbs up as always. If you haven't already, comment down below. Let me know what's going on. That's about it. If you guys need coins, head over to my coin bank down below. Use code Poodle for 5% off. I'm out. Peace.